If you are looking for a Bugaboo Donkey 5, you may be wondering, what's the difference between the Bugaboo Donkey 5 and the Bugaboo Donkey 3, and was there a Bugaboo Donkey 4? In this video, I'm going to be breaking down a full comparison between these two strollers. I'm Ellie from Magic Beans Videos. I re review and compare baby gear, and you can buy the Bugaboo Donkey 5 from us for Magic Beans with free shipping. <laughs> So, there is no Bugaboo Donkey 4, they jump straight from 3 to 5, and there's some fairly significant differences between the two strollers. Um, in the past, when they went from the Donkey 2 to the Donkey 3, most of the updates were just cosmetic, but in this update there are actually some practical differences and I'm going to show them to you right now. So I have the Bugaboo Donkey 3 right here, and here is the Bugaboo Donkey 5. The first thing you'll notice is this sort of gray melange look was like, like that older look for it, and now they're kind of moving to these new soft touch fabrics and these more sort of like muted tones. So that's like a new like color palette that they're bringing into the um, Bugaboo Donkey 5. Um, just so you know, if you have a Bugaboo Donkey, original Bugaboo Donkey or a Bugaboo Donkey 2 or 3, whatever, all of the accessories and all of the different canopies and stuff are all cross compatible. So you can upgrade the old one for the new one, the new one for the old one, and or you can upgrade an older donkey with these fabrics. Um, but let's talk about the main differences. Number one, in the bassinet, you'll see it's just a normal bassinet in the Bugaboo Donkey 3, but for the Bugaboo Donkey um, 5, you now have a little peekaboo window in the actual base of the bassinet so that you can have airflow through in a warmer climate or in the summer, etc. You can see they have these like kind of little supports here, which you can easily sort of um, unvelcro and remove. So you can fold down the bassinet. In the old bassinet, they just had a different system. You see those things aren't there and it is not as easy to sort of collapse your, um, your bassinet with the old donkey. So that is an upgrade for the new donkey. But the other main difference between the two strollers is in the fold. Okay, so to fold down the Bugaboo Donkey 5, now you can see right here, um, right in the actual folding mechanism, in the Bugaboo Donkey 3, or two of the previous versions, the folding situation was underneath the handlebar. So your finger was underneath to fold it down, but in the newer version, they put the little white folding doohickey on the top, which is gonna be more similar in line with the other Bugaboo strollers that are here right now. Kind of a little more comfortable to fold it down. So um, to fold down the stroller, what you do is you just pull those two little mechanisms and it goes right down to your feet and then you can just kind of fold it up. Um, this was the same, again, similar deal with the Bugaboo Donkey, um, the Bugaboo Donkey 3. But now watch this. If I want to open up the Donkey 3, the old one, see I am lifting it and the handlebar isn't moving. So what I need to do is I actually need to grab underneath here, pull those white mechanisms, release it, now the handlebar moves. You see, I have to push the things, the handlebar moves. Then I lift it up and I can open up the stroller. It's like not a huge deal if you have an old donkey, but it would be much more convenient if you could just not have to worry about those little white handle things, the white doohickeys, and just uh, hold from the handle, lift up, and it opens right up. So it is a much more like a fairly more, much is a little extreme, a little bit more easy to unfold your Donkey 5 than it was the Donkey 3. The other thing is you can um, actually have three kids on the Donkey strollers by adding a comfort wheel board. So if you look at the back, the comfort wheel board is there sort of like right on board. You see how they have this little um, circle, um, little hole in the back here? These uh, right over here and over here, what you could do is you can pop in the Bugaboo Comfort wheel board without an adapter. If you look at the back of the old donkey, they don't have that mechanism there. So you actually have to use a, an adapter to add the Comfort wheel board to the back of the donkey three, which is less convenient. The other thing that I wanna point out is that the Bugaboo donkey five 
is three centimeters higher than the Donkey 3. You can see that, let me see, you can visually see this. You can see right here in the post, you could see that this is just a little bit higher. You could see that this is higher on the Donkey 5 than it was on the Donkey 3, so the baby is gonna uh, sit up slightly higher in this. I do a full review of the Donkey 5 with more detail about it, which you can check out after this video. And if you're still confused and have more questions, I'd recommend you go to mbeans.com slash consultations right now and book a virtual consultation. And remember, when you're making your decision to buy your Bugaboo Donkey 5, go check out mbeans.com because we offer it with free shipping. And I will see you at the next video. Thank you.